Do you want your Minecraft world to look as beautiful as this? Come on. You gotta admit, this looks pretty good. Those things are pretty ugly, though. Well, today, my dudes, I'm gonna be showing you how to download Optifine as well as download shader packs for Minecraft 1.16. Point four. Because I've been streaming a lot lately, this is my hardcore world, and a lot of people have been asking me, how do you get those shaders? Um, how do you install it? Where do you get it? And uh, please let us know. So today, I'm going to be going over that. Okay, so the first step to this tutorial, my dudes, we are going to be downloading Optifine. Optifine Minecraft 1.16.4. So scroll down into the description of this video, and you should see a little link called Optifine Link. Now, you're gonna go over and click download, all right? So click this right here, and you're gonna be sent to this page called Add Focus, and wait a few seconds up in this top right corner here, and once it's done, you're gonna hit skip, and then boom, you'll be redirected to the Optifine page and hit download. And it will come down into here, it'll say this type of file can harm your computer, do you wanna keep it? Now this is totally up to you. This is not my download link, this is Optifine's website. It's safe, it worked for me, but I can't guarantee your safety because it's not my website, but I'm just gonna let you know I downloaded it and it's fine, I haven't had any issues. Okay, so once you download this, we are now gonna go to the download folder. So once you located your download folder, where your downloads go from Google Chrome or wherever you're downloading this from, you will have Optifine here. Now this is a tricky part if you don't have Java installed. So I'm gonna right click on this and I'm gonna hit open with. Now if you do not have Java installed on your computer, you will need to install Java. So let me show you really quick. All you're gonna do is type in Java on Google, go to downloads and just download the most recent version of Java, okay? Just hit that agree and start free download, boom, you're done. Okay, now going back to this part, click on Optifine, go to open with Java. All right, then the next thing you're gonna do is make sure this lines up to your Minecraft and uh, it obviously should. Hit install and you're good to go. It'll quickly install on your Minecraft directory. Now, after you're done hitting install, open up your Minecraft launcher and you should be able to find Optifine 1.16.4 out of this drop-down box. If it's not there, you did something wrong, but this is pretty easy, come on. Um, so make sure you have that there. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to install a shader pack because now that Optifine is downloaded, I can show you guys, um, we're gonna click play and uh, it will be in there. All right, so once you start it up, we can go over to video settings and uh, now we can actually go through all the different things that Optifine added. Optifine's really, really cool. Um, it gives you a zoom feature. It gives you like all kinds of things to turn on details. And uh, you can also go to quality. And I really recommend this one. Um, under quality, there should be fancy. Here it is. Better grass. Put that on fancy. Just wait Wait until you see what that looks like. It looks really cool. So anyways, you guys can go ahead and check out all these different effects and all these different modifications you can do now to the visual effects and visuals in Minecraft. So the next thing we're going to want to download is a shader pack. So you guys can see here, I have tons of shaders downloaded. I absolutely love Sildur's um, shaders. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to get these in this file now once you're in this like on the shaders option all you gotta do is open your shader folder down here so let me go back and show you guys so we start from options we go to video settings we go to shaders right here and then boom down here in the bottom left it'll say shaders folder click on that it'll open it up for you now here you can see a bunch of different um, shaders folders that I have downloaded. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to download one for yourself and put it in this file. So I'm gonna go to sildersshaders.github. I will put this link in the description of the video as well if you guys want these shaders. So I'm gonna go under downloads here. So once you're under downloads, you guys can pick from all the different versions here. I'll do a review on every single version of Silder shaders, but I really recommend if you guys just want a very basic stock looking shader that doesn't change the world a lot, go with Silder's Enhanced Default version 1.11. All right, well, 1.11, not 1.111. But anyways, I recommend downloading that. So hit download on that. And of course, it's gonna bring you to the same web page that you went to for Optifine. Wait the three, two, one in the corner, hit skip. It'll bring you to Mediafire. Remember, download at your own risk. I download it and I don't have any problems. It comes up with an ad. Close that ad right away. All right, so now that it's in your download folder, let's go ahead and uh, open show in folder. 
and now we have Silder's Enhanced Default. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is I'm going to extract this to Silder's Enhanced Default folder. Now I am using WinRAR, okay? If you guys don't have WinRAR, there might be a Windows Extract button, but I'm honestly not sure but I am using WinRAR. It's a program, if you guys need to go download it, go ahead and download it, it's free, and they let you use it for free, it's pretty cool. So extract to Silder's Enhanced Default, we're gonna do that real quick, and then boom, you see that? Silder, boom! <laughs> Silder's Enhanced Default, grab that, we're gonna cut that, just cut it right there, and then now we're gonna navigate back to the shader pack, and we're gonna copy and paste it in here. And uh, obviously I already have it. There it is right there. It's in that pack now. And when you start Minecraft, it'll be right here. Silder's Enhanced Default. Now, if you guys are trying to get in these shader folders without actually going through Minecraft, let me show you. You just go to the start menu, go percent app data, just like that. Percent app data, hit enter. Go to dot Minecraft right at the top here. And then uh, go down to shader packs right here. And then there you go, you're in that folder as well. So this is how you install Optifine on 1.16.4. This is how you install shader packs on Minecraft 1.16.4. Point four. Super easy. Honestly, you guys can follow along. I'm sure at home, take the time. Seriously, it's worth it. Long as you have a decent computer, it will run all these shader packs pretty good. And Optifine makes your game run a lot better. It uh, literally, it's called Optifine for a reason. It fine tunes your graphics and everything. And you can adjust anything you want to make your game run at better, smoother frames. Now also one thing before I go, if you guys wanna know how to zoom in like this, let's just do the zoom in feature. If you wanna do this, the zoom in, it's actually C on your keyboard. And if you go over to controls, you can actually scroll down here and we should be able to find zoom right at the bottom here. You see the zoom, you can set that to any key you want. I wanted to add that in before I ended, just so you guys know that um, you do get a zoom feature with Optifine and it works really, really good. Make sure to go check out all these different settings. I'm sure you guys will have a lot of fun changing around your performance settings and everything and get a lot better of frames. All right, that is gonna be it for this video, my dudes. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to smash that like button. I'd really appreciate it. Let's try to get like 100 to 1,000 likes on this video. I'd super appreciate that my dudes and also if you're new to the channel and you want to become one of the dudes smash that sub button right away and don't forget to hit that bell all right thank you for watching i hope this helps you out i hope your game runs better i hope you enjoy your shaders because these look absolutely amazing all right peace out my dudes